Hi guys. Today I want to talk about um, something that I'm really seeing more and more as a great way to keep a really engaged community online and, uh, and get people interacting, get people following along and really caring about you. And that's by being thankful online, being thankful in general. Uh, that came about this week when, you know, the motivation for today's little lesson, I guess, came about this week when I got an opportunity to visit uh, an event that had Australian basketballer, um, Olympian Matthew Della Vadova. Uh, he's also a recent NBA championship winner with the Cleveland Cavs here. I've got the, got the hat to represent the theme today. Um, but someone who truly gets it in terms of being thankful for what he's got, appreciating you know, the different opportunities he's been given and saying thanks publicly to all the different people that have supported him along the way. And I think it's a lesson we can all learn. I hear from a lot of people that they're struggling to think of content that engages people, that builds their community. Now, the first thing I would always think, well, how did you get here? No one gets to where they're, where they're at alone. Who can you be thankful to? And how can you share that online? So, Dally, as I'll call him for, you know, he's thankful and he was thankful to his fans there on Tuesday. Um, and I was thankful to meet him because, you know, he's someone that not only have I um, admired as an athlete, but also, as I said, the content he creates. He's someone I lead athletes towards to look for examples. Because what he'll do is he'll, not, he'll talk about coaches, he'll talk about friends, he'll talk about teammates, he'll talk about, you know, charities he's worked with, um, you know, opportunities he's been given and showcase how thankful he is for them. And it's a great place to start if you want to build an engaged community. You know, of course, an audience is going to feel appreciated um, if you talk about them, if you thank them, if you share that, you know, you're listening and that you care about them. Uh, you know, for an individual and an organization, that's a great place to start. How can you lift the others up that are already supporting and showing you that they're following you? Um, it'll, build, it'll build your community. It'll build your profile. So uh, on the court... You know, Delhi, um, I guess he exhibits, you know, the attributes of sacrifice and, um, you know, teamwork, leadership, um, all those sorts of things, supportive, selflessness. And I think that's the type of stuff that you could be sharing in your content. So, you know, do you have a parent? Do you have a friend? Do you have a partner? You know, do you have a staff member you could be thankful for? And can you put something out online that'll get them really excited and, and you know, um, showing thanks showcases a positive culture it showcases your values and it builds your reputation you know and helps you shine online so it might be someone who helped you get through an injury it might be someone who helped you get through a subject it might be someone who helped you get through a busy time at work or a stressful time saying thankful to those people is a great way to build you know your community um, to lift other people up, which is fantastic, and uh, and really shine online. So, you know, I'd love to hear about the people that you want to say thank you to. Drop it in the comments here, and I'd love to hear and see who and why, you know, you're thankful to and, uh, and how you're going to show, show them. So, uh, until next time, thanks for watching.